Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this look was very highly requested and I just wanted to go ahead and create it for you. It's a lovely yet dark smoky eye with nude lips. I really hope you guys enjoyed this look and if you'd like to see how I created this look, then please keep on watching. Alright guys, so first we're going to prime our eyelids with the Urban Decay Primer Potion. And this will ensure that the eyeshadows last all day long. Next, I'm taking the Jumble Eye Pencil from NYX, and this is in the shade Black Bean. And this is going to allow that the black eyeshadow that I'm going to place on top just becomes more vibrant. And you just want to pack this all over the lid. And then take a flat shadow brush and just go ahead and smooth out any harsh lines. And just make sure to concentrate this color on the lid. Then taking my Lorac Pro, Pro Palette, I'm using the cream base shade and this is going to act as my first transition color and then I'm going to use the shade taupe and this is going to be my second transition color. You want to buff that all over your crease. Next I'm taking the shade black from the same palette on that flat shader brush. And you want to pack the black all over on top of the eye pencil that you placed and just go ahead and blend it also into the crease so that there's no harsh lines and just go back in with the blending brush and just blush blend out any harsh lines next i'm taking the shade espresso on the same fluffy blending brush and we're going to blend this into the crease and what you want to do here is create that fading effect from the black to the brown into the crease so that you have that fading effect in the crease and just make sure you keep blending so that there's no harsh lines. Then I'm going back into the palette and taking the shade white and nude with a pencil brush just to highlight the inner corners and then I took a blending brush and just blended it out. Then I'm also going to shade my brow bone with the same shades, with the same pencil brush, and just going back in and blending it out. Next I'm taking my pen liner. This one's from Bare Minerals, and you know how much I love my cat eyeliner. Now the thing is with this look, since the eyeshadow is so black, you may not see the eyeliner all as well, but you still want to make sure you make some type of liner just to bring the look together. And for this look, I did create an additional line in the corner of the eye just to extend the line a little bit and to make it more of a cat eye shape. and I just brought the line to the lower lash line and just extended the line and connected them also. And then I went ahead and curled my lashes and just prepped them with mascara. And I am using my CoverGirl Clump Crusher. This is by far one of my favorite mascaras around. And then before I put my lashes on, I was waiting for them to dry, so I decided to conceal my under eyes. And then I placed my Ardell Demi Wispies, my favorite lashes of all time. And then I just hit them with some mascara on the top and bottom lashes. Moving on to my face, I used the Too Faced Flush Blush in peach and I just used the fluffy brush for the face. You just put them on the apples of your cheeks and blend them out. Moving on to the lips, I did use a Bare Minerals nude lip pencil. I believe it's called Liberated and I just went ahead and filled in my lips right after I lined them in. And you could choose to leave the look like this but I like to choose to place a little more lipstick so I went ahead and used Be Free. It's actually one of their Moxie lipsticks in Bare Minerals. And this was a really pretty shade to put on top. And I placed it all over the lids. And then I realized as I was applying the lipstick, it had broke. I was so, so 
so upset. But nonetheless, I had to continue. So this is the final look, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And leave me a comment down in the section below if you'd like to see any looks or recreate anything you'd like to see. And until next time, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!